When driving the Jeep Wrangler off-road, the front axle takes tremendous amounts of lateral strain. Jarring forces travel through the track bar, which are felt in the steering. When you lift a Jeep, the stress inflicted on the track bar increases. The TerraFlex JL HD Forged Adjustable Front Track Bar is engineered to withstand these abusive side forces. The reinforced design improves steering response and handling. The adjustable front end features a turnbuckle design that allows for hassle-free installation and length adjustment. Our taller lift kit systems include an axle bracket, which corrects the steering geometry to eliminate bump steer. This axle bracket should be used in conjunction with the TerraFlex front track bar. For the purposes of this video, we'll show the installation of the track bar on a vehicle with a stock suspension. It's best to install the front track bar with the vehicle on the ground. Remove the factory front track bar. The factory length is a good starting point for the TerraFlex track bar length. But if you know that you need the length longer or shorter, then set it to that beforehand. Fine tuning adjustments can be done once the track bar is on the vehicle. Install the TerraFlex front track bar on the axle end. Keep things loose for now. Install the frame end. If the hole on the frame's bracket doesn't align with the track bar eyelet, then have someone turn the steering wheel until they align. You can also shift the axle using a ratchet strap. Tighten the bolts. The torque specifications shown on the screen are taken from the factory service manual. The TerraFlex HD track bar can be adjusted to center the axle. With the wheels perfectly straight, measure from the frame to the tire in the same spot on both sides of the vehicle. When the lengths match, then the axle is centered. To adjust the track bar's length with the track bar on the vehicle, use an adjustable wrench and extend or shorten the track bar. Tighten the clamp bolts using a 12.10 mm socket. When tightening two bolts side by side, it's important to cross-check the torque and make sure both bolts are fully tightened. 